I do not claim to be better than anyone, but some years ago, a friend told me she wanted to start an agricultural business. To make things easy for her, I advised her to begin to read books that would help her gain knowledge in that field. At another time, she said she wanted to start an agricultural business. Then I asked her if she had read a single book on her field. She said no, she doesn't even love to read. First, I stopped asking her about her dreams anymore because it was obvious this was only a wish. She wasn't serious about achieving it. Second, she confirmed my lesson about why people are never rich. They hate to learn, hate to act, and hate to persist. I knew well enough to let her go because it was obvious her so-called dream was not serious enough for her and she was unwilling to learn. So, such people will keep having repeated periods of lack. If you keep bothering yourself to help people who don't want to be helped, you will only be wasting your time and even pulling yourself backward. George Clarkson wrote in The Richest Man in Babylon, don't carry your friend's burden until it becomes yours. In today's video, I will be sharing with you three kinds of people you should not even bother to help because they will keep pulling you back and will keep wasting your time. If you're new here, subscribe to the channel so you'll watch other interesting videos like this. 1. People who are resistant to change Some time ago, a young man came to me to ask if I could teach him digital marketing. I agreed and we got started. After just one class, he came the next day and began looking for movies on my laptop. Since he was no longer interested in learning but was interested in movies, I obliged him. Sometimes, people want success but they are not willing to make the change to succeed. There can never and will never be a success without some changes you will have to make. The person we are now cannot become the kind of successful person we hope to be. Some people have chosen that they would remain the way they are yet they work hard night and day and never succeed. It's insanity to keep doing the same thing the same way and expecting a different result. I know people who keep saying they want to become rich but they have never read a single book on money. Some of them are so religious they hope that God would suddenly open the door for them to just walk in. I don't believe in luck and I sure don't believe God is Father Christmas. I believe very strongly that you must prepare for success if success will ever come to you. Nothing goes for nothing. If you are not willing to do the right thing to succeed, you will not succeed. Just as life has principles, success has principles and must be followed before you can have it. Number 2. People who are skilled at making excuses Millions of people are on this list. I used to be on this list too. Once I would tell people why I couldn't get anything done was because I wasn't feeling too well. The truth is, over the years, I have found we can do whatever we want to do if we would only make up our minds to do it, regardless of the circumstances. What we are not doing is what we have chosen not to do. So nothing can hold us back from doing what we want to do except ourselves. Excuses are lies we tell ourselves to defend ourselves. There is no single person who doesn't have an excuse for not pursuing success first. If you want it, you will find enough excuses not to become the person you are supposed to be. But successful people have learned to ignore excuses. If you can catch someone skilled at making excuses for everything, you have found someone who cannot succeed. No matter what you do for them, they will let you know why they couldn't get anything done with their lives. Don't bother yourself with such people. Number 3. People who will rather be dependent than take responsibility for their lives. I tell you, there are people in this world who think it is their right to leave off others. In my country, some 30 something year old adults still live in their parents house and leave off their parents. I don't have a problem helping people as long as you are willing to take responsibility for your life. A man once saw some young boys begging on the streets and offered to help them by giving them a small task of offloading cartons into a warehouse to make money for themselves. After working for one day, this boy stopped coming. Some days later, this man saw them on the streets begging. Apparently, they would rather beg than work. If you have people who would rather leave off you than work, avoid them like a plague. The Bible corroborates this by saying, those who do not work should not eat. 
those who do not take responsibility for their lives should not eat. Some people want to breed your heir if possible. In this part of the world, people value inheritance so much that as soon as a rich husband dies, the man's siblings and relatives would move in to take position of what belonged to the man, shoving the man's widow aside. People who wait for you to do for them what they should do for themselves are lazy buffoons who will constantly leave off you. Avoid them. If this video inspired you, like the video. We love you.